campuses, 4,090 kids, and <laughs> our system starts every single day by having accurate data. So we asked our teachers in the attendance initiative to make sure that they take timely and accurate attendance in the first 10 minutes of every day. The next 15 minutes is, occurring, is collecting all that data to make personal phone calls to each and every family in our district. And it's not an attendance phone call as much as a safety phone call. It sounds something like this. Good morning, Mrs. Brown. I'm calling because your student was marked absent at our school today. This is a safety phone call. Is your student with you? It's a very warm, caring, but very to the point and we're hoping to build relationships with that conversation. We want to keep track of all 4,090 kids in our school district. Uh, to my right are our data points that we use and to the, your other right, data points that we use. Um, I could share a little bit about the data, but really the, the data-driven the data decision-making we made is uh, daily. We look at attendance trends daily. Um, some of those things that we use the data for are when we see a blitz, uh, we call a blitz, when we have an uptick in flu-like symptoms, for example, we will take a look at the data, identify what classroom, even what bus route those kids take, and call a blitz. And I would call our transportation and our maintenance staff, please disinfect bus so-and-so or classroom so-and-so to make sure that it is timely and immediate. Wow. That's, that doesn't happen when, unless you have a very efficient running school district. Um, and then once we once we identify issues for attendance and we have a very systemic approach, we send letters of concern at four, seven, ten, and fourteen days of absences. Those absences are thresholds that are part of the Oregon Revised Statutes. But more than that, we take them to heart because it gives us opportunities to communicate with each and every family in a very timely and very specific way. And so, teaching staff that we have limited time with kids, making sure that we have our our support staff, our student services staff, informed to make every uh, interaction with kids meaningful is really the core of what we do. Out of 4,090 kids in our district, 962 have perfect attendance. Wow. Combined, we have 2,400 students, and that's 59% of our student population that have missed less than five days wow. of school which is unparalleled. It, there's no other district in Southern Oregon that I know of that has that kind of data. Across the state. Or across the state. state. <laughs> All right, we'll find out, we'll find out. <laughs>